AI-generated B-roll can add stunning visuals to your videos to keep your viewers watching for longer and save you from hours of trying to find perfect B-roll online. This video is going to show you a way to add AI-generated B-roll to your shorts, TikToks and Reels in seconds. First, I'll introduce you to the tool that does this for us. Secondly, I'll show you how to let the tool automatically choose and insert AI B-roll into your videos for you. Next, for those that want a higher level of control, I'll show you how you can instruct the tool to give you exactly the B-roll that you want. And if you stick around to the end, I'll give you tips on how to use the tool to make your TikToks, shorts and reels even better. So, jumping into things, here's the website that you'll find the tool. You'll see from the tagline here, the tool was made to allow people to turn one long video into multiple viral clips. But I've also found that this tool is perfect for letting us generate and add AI B-roll into our vertical videos. You'll see up here the tool is called Opus Clip. There's a link to get set up on a free trial to Opus Clip in the description to this video. And if you do leave to set up that free trial, make sure to come back to this video after because there's a specific process you need to follow to do this correctly. So to get started, once you're logged in, you'll see a screen like this. And we need to click this button here to upload our vertical video that we want be all added to. Once you've selected your video and it's been uploaded, you want to click on this button here first and just choose the language that your video is in. So mine's English, I'm going to choose English here. And then next, you just need to scroll down. We can skip everything that we're seeing here. And this is where we need to be. We need to make sure that we press this toggle here, only add caption without clipping. That won't make sense now, but trust me, that's what you need to click. And then you just need to make sure that the entirety of your video is included inside these sliders right here. And once you've done that, that's all we need to do at this stage. So you're just going to click this big button up here, get clips in one click. Okay, great. So after a few minutes, your video will be processed. You'll see the video that you uploaded here on the left. I uploaded a Mr. Beast clip just for this example. And over here on the right, you'll also see that everything that was said in your video has been converted into text. And this speech to text technology over here is a little clue of into how the AI generated B-roll works. We're gonna jump into all that in a second. To have that AI B-roll added, we first need to click edit clip down here. We're then going to jump straight into this design tab over here, so press that. And this is the area that we need to be looking at, generate B-rolls. And we wanna turn this from with stock to with AI because we don't want the tool to find us actual stock footage to use as B-roll. We want AI generated footage. Now, all I want you to do is press this toggle and and what the tool is going to do now is it's going to process your vertical video, decide what is the perfect AI B-roll footage for that video and insert that footage into your vertical video at the perfect times. While that's loading, let's just turn captions off because we don't need to bother about captions yet. Although that's a little sneak peek into something that I'm gonna show you a little later. Okay, great. So after about 30 seconds, the tool finished. And if we look over here on the timeline, we're now seeing these little squares above our clip. There's six that have been inserted into this vertical video. And those are the six pieces of B-roll footage that the AI has generated and inserted into our video. So what I'll do now is I'll play the first, let's say 25 seconds of this video, just so you can see the AI B-roll footage that's been inserted into it. And someone on Reddit was like, you should give your 20 million subscriber or for 20 million subscribers, you should plant 20 million trees. I was like, Mark, I know a million's <laughs> impossible, but get this, let's plant 20 million trees to celebrate me hitting 20 million subscribers. <laughs> and he's like, you're a fucking idiot. And I was like, let's do it. And then we we're like, you know, as we ran down the rabbit hole, we we're like, there's no world where we're doing this. And then we're like, well, what if we gather all our fans and yeah. we do like different events and- Pretty good if you ask me considering this video originally was just a single locked off shot looking at the guy talking. We've now got these images inserted on top of what he's saying to just make it that more interesting. That's how easy it is if you let the tool completely take control and decide the exact moments and the exact B-roll footage to insert into your vertical video. But what if you want more control like that? What if, well, let's jump back into this video. What if one of the pieces of footage it inserts, like this one, it inserts some trees. 
when the guy talking said rabbit hole. What if there's a moment like this where the B-roll that's inserted isn't perfect and you want more control? Well, there's a way that we can have that finer control over what B-roll footage the tool generates and inserts for us. And you guessed it, I'll run you through how to do that now. So let's jump back to that moment where it generated trees where really a rabbit hole would have been better. I've just selected that point in the timeline and we can see over here, this screen has popped up with the B-roll footage preview at the top left and this text instruction that was originally used to generate the image that was originally shown, these trees. What we can do is we can delete that prompt that was originally used and just type in our own instruction of what we wanna see at this point in time. So I'm just going to type a rabbit hole in the ground. I can choose the style of the AI image that's generated. So I could have photorealistic or one of these other styles, but I'm gonna keep it photorealistic. And now all I have to do is just press this button down here, generate and wait for my own personalized custom AI B-roll footage options to be generated at this point. And after about 30 seconds, you then get the option to scroll down and see what the AI has generated. And would you look at that? We have a rabbit peering out of a rabbit hole. Perfect. I can now click the AI B-roll that I want. And just like that, it's been added to my video. Let's quickly watch that and see what it looks like. And then we're like, you know, as we ran down the rabbit hole, we we're like, there's no world where we're doing this. And then we're like, well, what? That is damn well impressive if you ask me. The fact that we've added AI B-roll onto our TikToks, Shorts, Reels without having to download any footage, without having to use an editor, it's all been done automatically for us. And I'm told by the team very soon, if we just come out of this and we click onto the, the captions, the scripts, the transcript, shall I say, that very soon we're going to be able to actually generate videos at any point that we want to just by clicking on a word that we want turned into B-roll footage and the tool will generate B-roll for the word that we're currently highlighting at that point, which is a amazing addition. The fact that we can't choose where this B-roll goes, we have to kind of just go by what the tool is telling us at this point is a bit of a setback. And the fact that soon we'll be able to add AI B-roll at any point in our videos, well, that's just an addition I'm looking forward to seeing. But like I said, first off, the link to do all this and try this out yourself on the free trial is in the description to this video. Secondly, there's more stuff we can do with this tool. I wanna to show you quickly one of them. As well as adding B-roll into your clips, this tool can automatically add captions to your vertical video. You just turn this slider on, and if we scroll through the video now, you can see on the right, captions are added to follow what is being said. And then you also have like a ton of different template styles over here that you can choose to change how the text looks on the screen. I think we have to use Beastie, don't we, for this video as we've got Mr. Beast talking. And there's also a ton of additional features in this tool, which I run through in more detail in this video. And I also run through how you can use this tool if you want to. There's a way you could use it to generate thousands of YouTube shorts in say 10 minutes by using my bulk creation process. So if I watch that video next, remember to subscribe to the channel and good luck with your AI B-roll generation.